Hi, I'm Paolo Juan. Hi, I'm Crystal. Hi, I'm Nico Angelo Abio. Hi, I'm Yui Jandera de Salona. And we are the group of Pirates. We're here for you to show and discuss Ernst Zermelo's short biography and contributions. Ernst Zermelo is a well-known German mathematician who did pioneering work and contributions to the field of mathematics, especially in set theory. Ernst Zermelo is known for proving the well-ordering theorem in 1904 and for developing the zermelo frankel axiomatic set theory. Ernst Zermelo was a pioneering mathematician who worked on the foundations of mathematics in Germany. Ernst's parents were Ferdinand Zermelo and Maria Augusta Elisabeth Zegler. In the year 1889, Zermelo completed his secondary education at Lisen Tandetisches Gymnasium in Berlin. Students studying at multiple universities was standard practice in Germany at the time, and Zermelo did precisely that. He studied a wide range of courses at three universities, Berlin, Hale, and Freiburg, where he studied mathematics, physics, and philosophy. Trivia time! First trivia! 4 is the only number that has the same number of letters as its meaning. F-O-U-R Second trivia! Think to yourself. How I wish I could calculate pi, and then count the letters in each of the words off that sentence. You now have a way of remembering the first seven digits of pi. 3.141592 Set Theory from Ernst Zermelo Hilbert's axiomatic method is an important part of the context of Zermelo axiomatization. Zermelo adapted Hilbert's approach. Indeed, Zermelo developed his own distinctive approach. Zermelo earned to be a professor in Göttingen because of his work. Set theory gained a lot of popularity as a subject, like research, especially in the field of mathematics. When Zermelo gave his first contribution in set theory, and because of his work, he became a well-known mathematician. Zermelo has a lot of discoveries that prompted him to begin the set theory in the year 1905. Zermelo tried but failed to prove the consistency of his work. Axiomatization of Ernst Zermelo Zermelo continued to build and publish his works despite the failure and question about his axiomatic theory. In his axiom theory, Words are typically used rather than symbols, but in reality, he rarely used quantifiers in formal language. He used symbols like rotated E and inverted A. Rotated E means there exists and inverted A means for all. In the year 1908, German mathematician Ernest Zermelo presented the first axiomatization set of theory. Contributions of Ernst Zermelo Zermelo Frankel set theory is named after two mathematicians, Ernst Zermelo and Abraham Frankel. It is the most widely used mathematical framework for axiomatic set theory. It includes the historical problematic axiom of choice. In the second section, we look at the life and achievements of Ernst Zermelo. We show how we began working on set theory problems in the same way as David Hilbert did. It also shows his contribution to axiomatic set theory and his life and work. In the early 1990s, there was a contradiction about the Russell paradox. It was significant and noticeable to other mathematicians because of the clarity of the meaning of the set theory. The Russell paradox is ironed out by an axiomatic set theory name and called ZZF, Zermelo Prankel set theory. Ernst Zermelo proved that all sets can be well organized. 
showing the first abo step about Hilbert's continuum theory. His achievement brought him payment promotion with him being appointed professor of Gottingen in December 1905. Principia Mathematica was the most difficult theory that mathematicians suffered to use an interpretation in their professions. The proof sparked debate in the mathematical community and drew a lot of criticism. Most of it unfunded. Impact or success of set theory by the contributions of Zermelo. Ernst Zermelo was a significant mathematician as well as grandfather and architect, about whom any modern mathematician should understand far more than what is taught in university courses on set theory and logic. The Zermelo Frankel axiom are a set of axioms compiled by Ernst Zermelo and Abraham Frankel that make it very convenient for set theories to determine whether a given collection of objects with a given property describable by the language of a set theory could be called a set. Ernst Zermelo is known for proving the well-ordering theory in 1904 and for developing the Zermelo Frankel axiomatic set theory. Zermelo produced further substantial contributions to axiomatic set theory with the publication of Russell's Paradox, the set theory paradoxes were born in 1903. Based to Ernst Sermelo, discovered that there was a set conflict and this prompted him to begin the first axiomatization of set theory in 1905. Before re releasing his work, he attempted to demonstrate that his axioms were consistent, but he was unable to do so. Sir Melo left Gottingen in 1910 after being appointed professor of mathem mathematics at Zurich University. He resigned in 1916. In the year 1926, Sir Melo was assigned to an associate position in Fredberg, Amberska in 1935. In response to Hitler's assessment, Ascension to power, Sir Mello resigned from his position.